Hi, I'm Lauren Fix, the car coach, and now it's summer and it's time for those road trips. You know, why fly? It's expensive. When you can get in your own vehicle, drive when you want, stop when you want, and save money by bringing your own food, too. Here's some tips to keep you safer on the road. Number one, check your tire pressure. Really easy to do. Open up your driver's door. There's a sticker inside. Read that sticker. That tire pressure should match the tire pressure on your tire. How do you do that? Really easy. A digital tire pressure gauge. You take off the valve cap, push this on the valve stem. That correct tire pressure should match the number inside your driver's door. Very smart way to get the best life out of your tires. Better performance, better fuel economy. And hey, you know what? Tires can be expensive, so you want to make sure to get the most for your money. But while you're down there, take a look at the tread. Very easy to do. If you see a bulge or metal, or maybe the tire's worn, it's obvious you need new tires. But how do you know? Very simple. Take a penny out. Put Lincoln's head directly into the tread. If you can see the top of his hairdo, it's time to get new tires. Now, when you're looking for a new tire, it's smart to look for a tire that's great in wet, dry, and even snow. Look for an all-season tire. I recommend the Michelin Pilot Sport All-Season 3 Plus. It's an ultra-high performance tire that gives you the best in wet, dry, and snow. Really a great choice. Now, if you a little concerned on checking your tire pressure, maybe you want to know more about your tires, it's probably a good idea. Check out michelinman.com. Now, before you leave, you're probably going to fill up with a tank of gas. So I want to let you know that there are some impurities in fuel. And what does that mean? If you look at this valve, this is from an engine that I'm rebuilding. And I was really surprised to find this buildup. That's because of the impurities in fuel. So even in a brand new car, you have a full tank of gas? Well, it's building up these impurities. So every 3,000 miles, you should be adding a fuel additive. What, what, what does that mean? Well, let me show you. This is a bad spray on a fuel injector, and this is a clean one. This actually happens over a very short period of time. So I recommend Tecron Concentrate plus Complete Fuel System Cleaner. What it'll do is it'll make the valves look like this clean one. It'll make the fuel injector spray nice and clean like this. It's so easy. You just take a can of this black bottle, you pour it into your gas tank, fill up with fuel, and in one tank full, you'll actually clean out all those impurities, all that buildup. Better fuel economy, better performance, may even cause that check engine light to go out, and best of all, it's better for the environment. Kind of think of it like a, a juice cleanse for your engine. It really does work. And finally, an emergency kit is so important. Make sure that you have a tire inflation product, jumper cables, you can get yourself an LED light source, and of course, you want to get a first aid kit, blankets, and you can put it all in a little bag, just like this, even a rain poncho, all those little things you might need. I always say duct tape and zip ties, and you should be ready to go. Toss that in your trunk and leave it in there all year round. For more information and more great tips on saving money and getting that perfect emergency kit, you can go to laurenfix.com. Have fun on the road this summer, and be car smart.